Paul Grayson and Graham Napier are with us to reflect on a tense win over Mid Middlesex and to look forward to the remaining games in the 2020. Paul, start with this win over Middlesex, a rather close run thing. Yeah, very close. It was an ugly win. Um, you know, our batting never really got going until towards the end. Napes and Tendo played pretty well and Tim Phillips. So we got up to a score we felt was quite competitive. Maybe 15, 20 short. Um, I thought we looked a little bit nervous, a bit timid with our batting. Um, but uh, we got a score which we felt we could um, defend and um, we got early wickets. Middlesex are in a bit of a low run at the moment. I think if we'd been playing a better side tonight, we'd have lost. Um, but uh, it's like I say, it was an ugly win and the two points were the most important thing tonight. Yes, indeed. And uh, Graham, who got the Man of the Match award deservedly for his all-round performance, came and gave the uh, innings the impetus it needed right towards the end there. Some uh, typical little cameo role there from uh, you, Graham, um, and some valuable runs. Yeah, just came in and uh, it was sort of one of those situations where you have to sort of see off an over at least before you can try and give it a go. And uh, with the spinner on it, it seemed like the right, right person to target. Yes, indeed. And uh, although well, we got up to, uh, uh, well, a figure here that would probably uh, everybody would admit uh, would be below par. Uh, but we applied the pressure on Middlesex right from right from the start with some tight bowling, accurate bowling and took wickets just at the right time. Yeah, we came out with, um, with the intention of uh, getting the first punch in. And uh, we did that with, uh, with Tim getting a wicket in the second over. And that put us on, that put them on the back foot and us going, really, and, and got the crowd pumped up as well. Yes, indeed. And a couple of catches dropped off your bowling, which uh, didn't uh, improve the mood, I'm sure, and uh, increase the tension here. Um, and I think perhaps everybody in the crowd felt the tension, but in fact they rallied and uh, gave us great support tonight. Paul. Yeah, they were very good. Um, they're always good we, when we play well. And if we don't play well, we deserve to get on our backs. But I thought the lads showed a lot of character tonight to win that game. You know, it wasn't a typical Chelmsford wicket. Um, you know, sometimes in the past it's been flat and 170, 180 is a par score. But tonight maybe 150 was the right score to chase down. Um, so uh, overall, not a great performance, but uh, the two points are in the bag. And we know we've got a tough week this week. We've got to go down to Bath tomorrow to play Monday. Uh, Wednesday down at the Rose Bowl and, and Friday back here against, uh, against Glamorgan. So... You know, we're probably going to have to win three out of the last four to go through. Um, so um, it's down to us. Uh, we know we've not played really at our best in this competition yet. So, you know, Hampshire won it last year. They just sneaked through. Um, maybe that could be us this year. Yes, indeed. And uh, well, we're a better, certainly a better, better balanced squad with uh, with Graham in the in the side. Uh, Graham, you just come back from a serious injury, carrying a little bit of a knock there tonight. Um, confident of being fit for the vital games next week. Uh, it's too early to tell them. I haven't got to see the physio, um, but I, I think it's certainly doubtful, probably for Monday. But uh, we'll see how how we pull up during the week. Yes, indeed. Well, uh, you know, good luck to good good luck to all the lads. Uh, let's hope we uh, get back and we're talking, perhaps here from next week after another win, and uh, looking forward to ever closer to that quarter final place, Paul. Yeah, that's what we're all in for. As long as we get in the quarter final, we're not bothered. I mean, the chances of finishing the top two are pretty slim. So uh, all we're bothered about is getting a, getting in that draw. And uh, whoever we get, they won't want to play us because they, they know that we're a good side that's not quite firing yet. Yes, indeed. Thanks, Paul, and well done to you again, Graham.